good. All right, so um, we are going to uh, do the uh, sing the two national anthems down here and raise the flag, and then we'll go upstairs into the city council chamber for the uh, rest of the ceremony. All right, so we're going to start with the uh, Greek national anthem, and we're going to who's going to raise the flag, Dimitri? Can we get the flag ready to go? And we will raise it during, and who's going to lead us in the singing of the national anthem, the Greek national anthem? The, uh, Hellenic American the, kids. the children, okay. Once the flag's ready, we'll start. How's that? And remember, when that flag goes up and it stands next to this flag, you see the complete picture of democracy from the beginning to where we are today, right? So let's sing with enthusiasm. Children, the Greek national anthem. The mayor has invited us all inside to the city council chamber to continue. Αναστάσω Ιησούς από του τάφου καθώς προείπε, έδω και ημίν την αιώνιον ζωήν και το μέγα έλεος. Αμήν. Χριστός Ανέστη, Christ is risen. Χριστός Ανέστη. And next I'm going to ask uh, the Honorable Mayor of the City of Lowell, Sakari Chow, to have to say a few words. Mr. Mayor.
Zilti Ilada. Good morning, everyone. What an auspicious day this is to uh, welcome everyone to this historic building, uh, the chamber, and the city hall of the city floor. I am very honored to welcome all of you. And joining us this morning also are my colleague, city councilor Paul Ratayam. City Councilor Rita Mosia, <laughs> City Councilor Visna Nguyen, <laughs> and we have representatives from state, State Representative Rari Mon, <laughs> and State Representative Wana Howard. If I miss anybody, please uh, raise your hand, let me know. I know former Mayor William Samaras is sitting uh, down here to my left. He was very instrumental in helping establish the Kalamata uh, Lowell Sister City. And I will have him uh, uh, speak uh, in a bit also. And we also have um, Pastor Wheeler in the audience who has gone to every single uh, city event. Uh, Pastor Wheeler, uh, welcome and thank you for joining us this morning as well. <laughs> when I think about the uh, Greek community, I really think about the immigrant group that really helped build the city floor to where we are now. And the Greek community share a lot of history, a lot of experience with all the other immigrant groups that came to law, including my group of immigrants, my own people, the South A Southeast Asian community, because the gateway to law, to coming to have a safe and democratic, uh, good quality of life in the city of law is really through the Acre neighborhood. And having seen how the Greek community started with the acre and then rise up to other parts and other neighborhoods of the city. And that's really the pathway of the immigrants, of all the immigrants that came to the city. And for myself, when I first came to law, I went to the acre. I grew up in the acre and I grew up with going to the Moolah's uh, market and now uh, the Moolah's market basket. And today, this morning, when the delegation from Kalamata arrived first in Lowell. We went to visit uh, Market Basket on the boulevard and we had a great welcoming by the, the Moolah's uh, family and his staff. And now that we are here at Lowell City Hall, I mentioned earlier, every time I walk up the stairways to my office, the mayor's office, I look at the portrait of the first female Greek mayor, former mayor Sampas. And as you all know, um, I talked to former Mayor Bill Samaras, uh, who is also a Greek. <laughs> so despite the fact that I've been the, the face of this ceremony, but I could not have done it without really the guidance of, of uh, Mayor Samaras, who established uh, this sister city in the beginning. My role is really to make sure that it is successful presently and to carry this forward into the future because linking history, culture, education, and economics with our hometown, with our homeland in the past will determine the success of our future here in America. And with that said, I would like to read the resolution that the city council voted on just this past Tuesday after a couple of years that the motion was passed by uh, proposed by former Mayor Bill Samaras, and it was the motion was passed back then, and we took a vote on the resolution just this past Tuesday in welcoming the Kalamata delegation. So I shall read the resolution right now. In City Council, resolution supporting and establishing, establishing a sister city relationship with Kalamata, Greece. Whereas the city of Law and Kalamata, Greece, 
share a desire that the city of Lowell become a sister city with Kalamata. And whereas the city of Lowell is cognizant of the large population of Lowell residents with strong family ties to Greek heritage, Kalamata and Lowell share a pride in Greek culture, history, food, and language. The Hellenic American residents of law are dedicated to keeping these ties to their Greek counterparts strong. And whereas Lowell and Kalamata believe it is to be in their collective interest to broaden and strengthen ties between the two cities, they place similar values on scholarship, tourism, economic development, and the renovation of old industrial mill buildings. And whereas Kalamata wishes to request a sister city relationship with the city of Lowell, Massachusetts. And wherefore, the city of Lowell wishes to establish and officially recognizes a historical, cultural, and humanitarian link with Kalamata, Greece, in the form of a sister city relationship. Be it resolved by the City Council of the City of Law as follows, that we, the members of the City Council, be on record as supporting and establishing a sister city relationship with Kalamata, Greece, submitted by myself, signed by myself, and the entire City Council. Thank you for allowing the City of Law to establish this relationship and in a few moments, we will sign the documents. Next up is uh, the chairman of today's event, Demetrius Mateos. Demetrius. Thank you, Mr. Panayotakos. Mayor Vasilopoulos, Mayor Ochao, distinguished friends, Lowell is in Kalamata is rewriting history again. Few bonds can rival the strength and fortitude of siblingness. Even as a brother can be different from a brother and a sister can be different from a sister. Siblings share common qualities and characteristics that bind them together and differentiate them from others. These binding ties are often inherent in their nature, in their foundation and outlook, and in their traditions. Such is the bond of sisterhood that we are here to celebrate today between two great cities. Lowell, Massachusetts, Massachusetts, and Kalamata, Greece, whose common purpose has brought them together to become a celebration of strength and res resilience, a revolutionary spirit that sets both of these places apart from others anywhere in the world, a commitment to making life better for people, for providing opportunity, and for fighting against injustice, connect Lowell and Kalamata, Greece, in a way that is special and unique. One launched the American Industrial Revolution, the other launched the Greek Revolution of 1821. Both cities are places of hope and vision, of bravery, resilience, and hard work. It is this embodiment that led me to propose to, make a, to Mayor Samaras himself a, defend, a descendant of parents who immigrated to Lowell from Kalamata, that Lowell should partner with Kalamata as a sister city. Although I am not myself a native of Kalamata, I feel like a sort of godfather to this sisterhood. And as a Greek American immigrant who has lived in Lowell for over half a century, I am honored and proud to see this partnership come to fruition. It has come about as the result of a great deal, 
of hard work from many individuals, including leaders in both Lowell and Kalamata, who formalized this relationship and codified its existence. Their visionary leadership is something we can all be proud of indefinitely in the years to come. It is certain that to bring about the kind of growth and progress that we have been hallmarks of each city. Now they are each stronger because they are together and because they are united in the mission to continue to promote growth and opportunity for new generation of Greeks, Greek Americans, and all the people in the fields of education, commerce, tourism, economic development. I would like to thank the Federation of the Hellenic American Societies of New England for the honor to bestow to me to be part of this historic event. Thank you. Great. And as uh, Dimitri said, uh, the person who without his leadership uh, today would not have happened, uh, former mayor of the city of Lowell, William Samaras. Billy, come on up. Thank you, Senator. Good morning, everyone. And a special welcome to Mayor Vasilopoulos uh, to our, and his staff to our city. Thank you for coming. This meeting has been a long time coming. We started this venture several years ago, but as you know, everything came to a stop with COVID. This project was, not in, was important not just for creating a sister city, but it was part of our goals, student exchange, cultural exchange, seminars on revitalization of our various cities. At this point, though, some of you might say, how did we choose Kalamata? Yes, I did play a part in this originally, because originally my family came from Mani and Lagadia. But as we traced the roots of our family, when they came to this country, they came through Kalamata, and many moved into Kalamata. But also, as a parent, many years ago, I brought my wife and my children to uh, Greece, and the city that we fell in love with was Kalamata because of its seaport, music, its food, but more important than that, its people. We were so warmly received. It was like everyone we met was a cousin. Yes, COVID slowed us down. But with the help of Bill Kafkas, Demetrius Matthias, we made this work, especially with your help, Mayor Vasilopoulos. Absolutely. It's been a long trip to get here, but I feel this program will strengthen the bonds between the Greek community in Greater Lowell and in Kalamata. That's what it's all about. It's revisiting our roots for us in one sense and for you and revisiting history, the seat of democracy, so, so many things. This is gonna be a wonderful project. But I would be remiss if I did not thank Mayor Chow for his work. Because quite often, sometimes, when you have a project, if your political career ends at a certain point, a lot of your programs end. But, the, but this city council, and we have several city councils here, and Mayor Chow, voted to continue this program and actually did a lot to enhance this program to really truly make it work. The only thing that bothers me about this, a couple of friends came up and said, you know, Mayor Chow did a great job. In fact, he's better looking than you and I think he knows more Greek than you do. <laughs> but outside of that, I can handle it. Everybody, welcome to this wonderful day. Thank you for everything. And next up, representing the organization that was uh, integral in this, um, the, Hellenic, uh, the Federation of Hellenic American Societies of New England, uh, its president, Vasilios Bill Kafkas.
Thank you, Senator Panagiotakos. Mayor Chao, Mayor Vasilopoulos, Honorable Council General of Greece, Mr. Ephemiu, Father Nicolai, Councillors from the City of Law, we have uh, Rita Merciopoulos here too. Thank you. Thank you all of you for what you have done for this project. About um, three years ago, a member of the Federation Board, Mr. Mateos, approached me and said, Mr. President, I had a talk with uh, Bill Samara, the mayor of Lowell. He wants to establish a sister cities with Greece. And we came up with a name of um, city close to your neighborhood in Greece, Kalamata. And I said, well, let's talk about it. I did not want something to be just on paper because papers we sign every day. But I wanted something that is going to be for the future, for people in business, for education, for tourism. And today we have many people from Kalamata into Lowell with uh, Mayor Vasilopoulos in those fields. None of this would have happened if the Board of Directors of the Federation did not agree to go ahead with this. I want to thank each and everyone who helped, especially the people that they have business in the area. And I'm going to mention, why not, Mr. Barakis, Mr. Dimoulas, and many, many others, Sophia's, you will see them on the booklet that you have. They helped a lot. Without the news media, and we have here Mr. Kalmukos from the National Herald of New York, and many others, the Lowell Sun, we wouldn't have done it. Each and every one contributed to this project, and I want to thank them all. However, we have many, many things to do. Their program is full today. They're going to go home, back to the hotel tonight, and they're going to be exhausted. Guess what? It's going to happen the same thing tomorrow, Saturday and Sunday. I know what's going to happen when we go to Kalamata. They're going to pay me back, <laughs> but that's okay. There is somebody here that we went to the university back a few years. I'm not going to mention how many, who said, uh, Bill, we went to school together, but you look a little bit old. Please don't mention who I am. Thank you for coming from Kalamata. Um, we will have meetings with the people from the University of Lowell, with Middlesex College. Um, we will have uh, meetings with the um, academians in Boston, MIT, Harvard, the Hellenic College, Emmanuel College, and elsewhere. Please help this project, because if it stay on paper, nothing is going to happen. Κύριε Δήμαρχε, καλωσορίσατε στην πόλη του Λόλ. Μας πήρε τρία χρόνια. Επισκέφθηκα την πόλη σας και ευχαριστώ για τη φιλοξενία δύο φορές στην Καλαμάτα, παρότι δεν είμαι από τη Μεσσηνία. Είμαι όμως αυτή τη στιγμή από την Καλαμάτα. Είμαι ένα κομμάτι από εσάς. Καλωσορίσατε στην ιστορική πόλη του Λόλ. Καλή διαμονή στη Νέα Αγγλία. Θα σας δούμε πολλές φορές και ιδιαίτερα στην παρέλαση της Βοστόνης που είναι την Κυριακή. Καλό όλο τον ελληνισμό και τους φίλους τους να έρθουν. Και θέλω να καλωσορίσω επίσης και όλους τους φίλους που ήρθαν από την Καλαμάτα. Έχουμε πολλή δουλειά μπροστά μας και θέλω να σας πω ότι εάν δεν γινόταν και το γνωρίζετε πολύ καλά, αν δεν συνέβαλε η Ομοσπονδία, αυτό το, το πρόγραμμα δεν θα γινόταν. Και θέλω να ευχαριστήσω όλο το Διοικητικό Συμβούλιο της Ομοσπονδίας, το Τωρινό και άλλους ανθρώπους που συντέλασαν σε αυτή την ωραία εκδήλωση και εύχομαι καλή συνέχεια. Ευχαριστώ πολύ. Thank you.
Before we get to our next speaker, there is one person that I'd like to uh, single out because uh, consistently, um, day in and day out when he's on the radio, he promotes our Greek heritage and history, and that's Teddy Panos of WCAP. Ted, thank you. We are honored to have with us today the Council General of Greece, Stratos at the meal. Council. Thank you, State Senator, uh, Mayor Chao, uh, City Councilors, Mayor Vasilopoulos, former Mayor Samaras, Mr. Vasilios Kafkas, President of the Federation of the Hellenic American Society of, of New England, uh, Senators, dear friends, Kalimera Pedia, Father uh, Nicola, uh, it, is, uh, it is an honor for me to be here. Uh, with you. This is uh, the last uh, year uh, I'm, in, uh, I, I'm in New England and the last time I am officially in uh, Lowell and I'm very glad that they assist in this uh, very important meeting, uh, a meeting that gives us the opportunity to reiterate uh, the bonds of uh, uh, friendship and cooperation that tie so strong uh, Kalamata and Lowell, Greece and the United States. As very well Mr. Matthäus mentioned it, these ties and bonds are the, the bonds and the ropes that tie us together. And uh, this is an historic initiative and I would like to praise the Federation uh, that has supported this initiative and Mayor Samaras. And I would like to thank Mayor Chao for embracing and continue uh, this initiative and continue Mayor Samaras' uh, decision. Uh, this is important. Lowell. Uh, has, uh, has been known as the Acropolis of the Hellenism of America. This is a very important gate for Greek immigrants. I'm also the son, the son of Greek immigrants from Asia Minor who settled in Greece and in 2022 we commemorate the 100 years from the exchange of population and expulsion of Greeks from Asia Minor. So I know how it is to be uprooted from a place and to uh, grow new roots in, uh, in another country as the immigrants who came here to, uh, to America. And uh, the Greek American community is present everywhere. Just outside the, uh, the city hall, you, you can see the statue of Christos Rusis, of a police officer who died during his duty, a Greek American police officer who is part of uh, the mosaic of the multi-ethnic multi tapestry of, of Lowell from immigrants from uh, Asia, from Latin America, from Europe, all those um, uh, beautiful pieces of this tapestry. And uh, I'm uh, very confident and sure that this historic cooperation will open new, uh, new roads and paths of uh, transport, cooperation, uh, trade, uh, and I think that there is an opportunity here for educational uh, cooperation, for academic exchanges, for business exchanges. So I would like to praise you for this initiative and thank you very much for this very important uh, decision, an historic decision. Θα ήθελα να πω και στα ελληνικά ότι είναι πάρα πολύ σημαντική αυτή η πρωτοβουλία. Να θα ήθελα να πενέσω όλα τα μέλη της ομοσπονδίας για τη δουλειά τους. Είναι ένα πρόγραμμα που το ξεκινήσαμε από την αρχή και το φέρναμε στο τέλος. Σε συνεργασία με, τους, ε, με, τα, με τις δύο πόλεις και τους δημάρχους, τον Δήμαρχο Σαμαρά, τον Δήμαρχο Τσάου και τον ε, κύριο Βασιλόπουλο. Και νομίζω ότι αυτή η πρωτοβουλία, ειδικά σε μια εποχή που ξεκινάει μετά από πάρα πολλά χρόνια η απευθεία πτήση, μετά από 25 χρόνια η απευθεία πτήση Βοστόνης Αθήνας, θα ανοίξει και αυτή η πρωτοβουλία νέες δυνατότητες συνεργασίας και επιχειρηματικών, πολιτιστικών και εκπαιδευτικών ανταλλαγών. Συγχαρητήρια σε όλους. Just let me single out a couple other people too. Uh, where we're on the border of New Hampshire, where it's a lot of cross uh, going back and forth between Massachusetts and New Hampshire, it's a benefit for both sides, believe me. And uh, we have a state rep, a state representative from New Hampshire, Estathia Boris. Thank you for coming.
and also our new treasurer here in the city of Lowell, the gentleman who collects the taxes but also watches the money for the city of Lowell, Ted Paniotopoulos. But next up is our honored guest. Um, we're so happy to have him and his contingent here with us today, the Honorable Athanasios Vasilopoulos, Mayor of Kalamata. Θα με βοηθήσει και η κυρία Μακροπούλου με τη μετάφραση. Πατέρα Νικόλαε, κύριε Δήμαρχε του Λόβελ, κύριε πρώην Δήμαρχε του Λόβελ, κύριε Γενικέ Πρέσβη, κύριε Πρόεδρε της Ομοσπονδίας, αγαπητά μέλη του Διοικητικού Συμβουλίου, εκλεκτοί παρεμβισκόμενοι, αξιότιμοι παρεμβισκόμενοι, κυρίες και κύριοι, συνέλληνες, καλημέρα σας και χρόνια πολλά. Επιτρέψουμε την ευκαιρία της παρουσίας σήμερα και την παρουσία του Δημάρχου να σας μιλήσω για την Καλαμάτα του σήμερα. Η Καλαμάτα είναι το οικονομικό, εμπορικό και πολιτικό κέντρο της Νότιας Πελοποννήσου. Είναι μια πόλη διαρκώς αναπτυσσόμενη, με αντικειμενικά πλεονεκτήματα και πολλές δυνατότητες πρόοδου. Ο αγροτικός τομέας στην περιοχή μας είναι ισχυρός, καθώς παράγονται σπουδαία προϊόντα, αποτελούν τη βάση της μεσογειακής διατροφής, είναι η μεσηνιακή δίαιτα, Πολλά από τα οποία είναι πολύ γνωστά, όπως η ελιά καλαμών, το λάδι, τα σίκα και πολλά άλλα. the consumption of which contributes to maintaining good health and longevity. Η Καλαμάτα διαθέτει φυσική ομορφιά, συνδυάζοντας το βουνό τα Ήγετος με το υπέροχο παραλιακό μέτωπο 14 χιλιόμετρων, το οποίο αποτελεί μέρος του αστικού ιστού. Αυτή η αστική παραλία διαθέτει πιστοποίηση ότι είναι καθαρή, αλλά και ασφαλής για κολύμβηση. Η Καλαμάτα διαθέτει λιμάνι, όπου φιλοξενούνται εκεί κρουαζιερόπλια και μέγα γιότ, διεθνές αεροδρόμιο, που συνδέεται η Καλαμάτα με 34 προορισμούς. Σύντομα θα έχουμε και υδατοδρόμιο, που θα αναπτυχθούν και άλλοι προορισμοί. Νοσοκομείο, πανεπιστήμιο με 7 τμήματα και ένα αυτοκινητόδρομο που συνδέει την Καλαμάτα σε 2 ώρες και 15 λεπτά με το μεγάλο αστικό κέντρο την Αθήνα. Η πόλη μας αποτελεί τον ιδανικό προορισμό για τον επισκέπτη, παρέχοντας πολλές επιλογές δραστηριοτήτων, αλλά και πολλές δυνατότητες διασκέδασης. Calavada has natural beauty, combining the Mount Aigetos with a magnificent 14-kilometer long coastal front. Being part of the urban city, this urban beach is certified that its waters are clear and safe for swimming. Calamata has a port, an international airport, and a new motorway, connecting it safely and quickly to Athens within about two hours. Our city is the ideal destination for the visitor providing many activities and entertainment options. Το σημαντικότερο γεγονός της μακρόχρονης ιστορίας της πόλης είναι η κήρυξη ελληνικής επανάστασης στις 23 Μαρτίου 1821. Στη Βυζαντινή Εκκλησία των Αγίων Αποστόλων, το σύμβολο της πόλης, ευλογείται η επαναστατική σημαία και από εκεί ξεκινάει η επανάσταση του 1821. Το πρώτο κοινοβούλιο των επαναστατημένων Ελλήνων, που ονομαζόταν Μεσσηνιακή Σύκλητος ή Μεσσηνιακή Γερουσία, συντάσσει δύο, πολλά σπουδαία διπλωματικά έγγραφα. Κείμενα με τα οποία εξηγεί γιατί ξεσηκώθηκαν οι Έλληνες. Αναλύει τους λόγους που αποδεικνύουν ότι ο αγώνας τους είναι δίκαιος και ζητεί τη βοήθεια των ξένων δυνάμεων. Τα κείμενα αυτά εστάλησαν από την Καλαμάτα και αποτελούν τα πρώτα πολιτικά και συνάμα διπλωματικά έγγραφα των επαναστατημένων Ελλήνων. Το πρώτο είναι η προειδοποίηση στα ευρωπαϊκά σαυλάς που απεστάλλει προς βασιλικές αρχές 
της Ευρώπης 23 Μαρτίου 1821 και υπογράφεται από τον Αρχιστράτηγο του Σπαρτιατικού και Μεσσηνιακών Στρατευμάτων Πέτρο Μαυρομιχάλη και τη Μεσσηνιακή Σύκλητο. Το τέταρτο, ίσως είναι και το πιο σημαντικό, είναι η προκήρυξη προς το Αμερικανικό λαό. Αυτό είναι ένα από τα πρώτα κείμενα που ενώνουν αμάς τους Έλληνες και τους Αμερικάνους. Εστάλει στις Ηνωμένες Πολιτείες το Μάιο του 1821 και με αυτό η Μεσσηνιακή Σύγκλητος ζητούσε βοήθεια από το Αμερικανικό λαό και την κυβέρνηση του Προέδρου Τζέιμς Μονρό. Ο Έλληνας Λόγιος Αδαμάντιος Κοραής που ζούσε στο Παρίσι παρέδωσε το κείμενο αυτό στον Αμερικάνο πρέσβη του Πανεπιστημίου του Χάρβαρτ, Έντουαρτ Έβερτ, από την πολιτεία της Μασαγουσέτης. Αυτός ο μεγάλος πολιτικός από τη δική σας πολιτεία που δίδασκε αρχαία ελληνική λογοτεχνία στο Χάρβαρτ και διέπρεψε κατακτώντας αξιώματα στη χώρα σας, έκανε γνωστό στι Ηνωμένες Πολιτείες τον αγώνα των Ελλήνων για την απελευθέρωσή τους από την τερανία με το κείμενο που εστάλει από την Καλαμάτα. Αυτό το κείμενο, αντίγραφο του κειμένου, το έχω φέρει να σας το προσφέρω. The most remarkable event in the city's long history is the proclamation of the Greek War of Independence against Turkish tyranny on March 23, 1821. In the Byzantine Church of the Holy Apostles in Kalamata, the symbol of the city, the revolutionary flag is blessed and from here the revolution of 1821 begins. The first parliament of the rebellious Greek people, called the Messiniac, Messiniac, uh, Messiniac Senate, or the Messenian Senate, draws two major diplomatic texts, explaining why the Greeks rose up, analyzing the reasons that prove that their struggle is just and fair. These texts were sent from Kalamata and are the first political and at the same time, diplomatic documents of the Greek revolutionaries. The first one is the warning to the European backyard and was sent to the Royal Court of Europe on March 23rd, 1821. The second is the proclamation to the American people. This is the one of the text to unite us, the Greeks with you, the Americans. It was sent to the United States in May 1821, but by which the Messenian Senate asks for the help of the American people and the government of the President James Monroe. The Greek scholar Adamandios Corais, who lived in Paris and contributed to the revolution, delivered this text to the American professor of Harvard University, Edward Everett, of the Senate of Massachusetts. This great politician from your state who taught ancient Greek literature at Harvard and excelled in gaining great offices in your country made known in the United States the struggle of the Greeks for their liberation from tyranny with this text which was sent from Kalamata. Now you can see how many things we have in common and our mayor has a copy of this proclamation which he will uh, offer to the city of Lowell. Αγαπητή εκπρόσωπη του Λόουερ, η αδερφοποίηση πέρα από το αισθανιστηματικό χαρακτήρα λόγω τη έντονη παρουσία ελληνική κοινότητα στην περιοχή σα, ευελπιστούμε ότι θα προωθήσει τη μεταξύ μα σχέση στου τομεί του πολιτισμού, τη εκπαίδευση, των επιστημών, του τουρισμού και του εμπορίου. Μέσω τη αδερφοποίηση των πόλεών μα, εκδηλώνουμε με υπευθυνότητα την κοινή μα βούληση να συνεργαστούμε με πνεύμα αδερφοσύνης και αλληλεγγύης σε μια σειρά θεμάτων αμοιβαίου ενδιαφέροντας. Και παράλληλα, ευελπιστούμε ότι θα επιτύχουμε την πολλαπλή διασύνδεση μεταξύ των πόλεών μας, των πολιτών μας, δημιουργώντας έτσι κλίμα φιλίας και ανάπτυξης και συνεργασίας. Εύχομαι να ξεκινήσουμε με τρόπο αποδοτικό και με χειροβιαστά αποτελέσματα προς όφελος και των δύο πόλεων. Dear representatives of Low, the twinning in addition to the emotional character it has for all of us due to the strong presence of the Greek community in your area, we hope that, this, that, that it will promote cooperation between us in the fields of culture, education, science, tourism and trade. Through the town twinning of our cities, 
we responsibly express our common will to work in a spirit of brotherhood and solidarity on a range of issues of mutual interest and at the same time, we hope to achieve multiple interconnections between our citizens, thus creating a climate of development and cooperation. I hope we get started in a profitable and tangible way for the benefit of both cities. Ladies and gentlemen, Kalamata Apotelis, Simera Miapolis, Sichroni, Meorama, Diarcosan of the Somen. Ding it yet in prosochis the prosasia to perivalodos, ke paracolthi anische the climatiki alagi. Για το λόγο αυτό, έχουμε καταθέσει υποψηφιότητα για ένταξη καλάματα στο δίκτυο των 100 έξυπνων και κλιματικά οδέτερων πόλεων τη Ευρωπαϊκή Ένωση. Σήμερα, λοιπόν, είναι για την Καλαμάτα μια ιστορική ημέρα. Πέρα από ότι γινόμαστε αδερφέ πόλη με το Λόουελ, 12 η ώρα σήμερα, ώρα Βρυξελών, ανακοινώθηκε ότι η Καλαμάτα είναι μια από τι 100 έξυπνε και κλιματικά οδέτερε πόλει. Δηλαδή, η Καλαμάτα θα γίνει πόλη οδηγό για όλη την Ευρωπαϊκή Ένωση, εφαρμόζοντα και υιοθετώντα πρακτικέ. Πολύ σπουδαίε, πρωτοπόρε για να οδηγήσει και τι άλλε πόλει στο να γίνουν έξυπνε αλλά κυρίω να γίνουν κλιματικά οδέτερε για να προστατεύσουμε το περιβάλλον μα. Θα ήθελα να βοηθήσει, Νίκο. Κυρίε και κύριοι, Καλαμάτα είναι σήμερα μια πόλη που κοντινά δημιουργεί με μια βίζια. Έχει σημαντική ευθύνη για την ευρωπαϊκή πρόσφυξη και είναι ανησυχητικά για την κλιματική κλιματική. Για αυτήν την ευθύνη, έχουμε δημιουργήσει μια κάντηση. Candidacy for the inclusion of Kalamata in the network of 100 climate neutral cities of Europe. We are in the present position today to announce that Kalamata was voted uh, to be one of the uh, 100 climate neutral cities of Europe. Uh, it was voted uh, today, yesterday or today, yeah, yeah. in Brussels. Okay. And this is a great honor, privilege, and it shows it will give us many opportunities to do many creative things in the future. Uh, the rich past meets the dynamic present with culture as a dominant feature. On a regular basis, we organize events of international scope, such as the Kalamata International Dance Festival, in which several bands from the U.S. say have appeared. The schools of cultural education of the municipality of Kalamata have acquired international prestige. Every summer at the University of Kalamata, there's a school where citizens of, uh, with Greek roots from the USA, Canada, and other countries learn the Greek language and history. These people who are mostly young are the connection with the US. We want this connection to become even stronger and more creative. Εκ μέρου του Δημοτικού Συμβουλίου Καλαμάτα και όλων των κατοίκων τη Καλαμάτα, χαιρετίζουμε την ιδέα που έγινε πράξη. Η πόλη μα, η Καλαμάτα και το Λόουελ, γίνονται αδερφέ πόλει. Ευχαριστώ τον Δήμαρχο του Λόουελ, τον αξιότιμο κύριο Σακάρου Τσάου, το Δημοτικό Συμβούλιο του Λόουελ, τον πρώην Δήμαρχο κύριο Βίλιαμ Μπίλ Σαμαρά και όλου του πολίτε και επιχειρηματίε τη περιοχή αλλά και τη ευρύτερη περιοχή του Λόουελ. Ιδιαίτερε ευχαριστίε θα στον. Πρόεδρο τη Ομοσπονδία, τον κύριο Καφκά, που πραγματικά δεν θα γινόταν τίποτα χωρί τη δική του επιμονή, τη δική του προσπάθεια. Όπω βέβαια και όλα τα μέλη του Διοικητικού Συμβουλίου για το όραμά, όραμά του. Να ξεκινήσουν αλλά και να ολοκληρώσουν αυτή η σπουδαία ιδέα. Πιστεύουμε ότι μόνο θετικά μπορεί να λειτουργήσει αυτή η ιδεοποίηση και για τι δύο πόλει. Και με την ευκαιρία αυτή, σα προσκαλώ να επισκεφτείτε την πόλη μα, την Καλαμάτα, την Ελλάδα και να ανυπομονώ να ενισχύσουμε το δεσμό. Μεταξύ των πολεών μα. Εκτιμώ ότι η διάθεση των δύο πλευρών για συνεργασία μπορεί να προσφέρει πολλά και στο Λόουελ και στην Καλαμάτα. Εύχομαι δε αυτό να γίνει η πράξη και διαβεβαιώνω ω Δήμαρχο Καλαμάτα ότι ο Δήμο Καλαμάτα θα κατεβάλει κάθε προσπάθεια για την απίτευση αμοιβαίου ωφέλου. Σα ευχαριστώ. Finally. On behalf of the Municipal Council and all the residents of Kalamata, we welcome the idea that is becoming a reality. Our city, Kalamata and Lowell, are becoming sister cities. I would like to thank the Mayor of Lower, the Honorable Sokari Chow, the Lowell City Council, the former Mayor, William Bill Samaras, and all the citizens and businessmen from Lowell and the wider area. Special thanks to Vasilios, Kafkas, the president of the Federation of Greek American Companies of New England and its board of directors for their vision to start and complete this great idea. We believe 
that this town twinning will, be, will only be beneficial for both cities. On this occasion, I would like to invite you to visit our city, Kalamata, Greece, and I look forward to strengthening the bond between our cities. I believe that the willingness of both sides for cooperation can offer a lot to both Lowell and Kalamata. I wish this to happen, and I assure you as a mayor of Kalamata that the municipality of Kalamata will make every effort to achieve mutual benefit. Thank you. So, uh, our mayor would like to uh, present his associates. Mr. Stavros Tupas is the president of the Sanatexiac of Melitirio Messinias and the president of the Epichirimatic Cosmo. Nico, please. So, Mr. Stupas represents the, the business uh, side of, uh, of Kalamata, right? Of the, the, the Messinian Chamber, yes. We're so happy to be here. And of course, there are so many opportunities that are going to uh, go into fruition in the future. Ο κύριος Νικόλας Ζαχαριάς είναι κοσμήτερας και καθηγητής του Πανεπιστημίου Πελοποννήσου. Και είμαστε βέβαιοι ότι θα πολλά έχουμε να δώσουμε στον τομέα της εκπαίδευσης. Κύριε Ζαχαριά. On behalf of the University of the Peloponnese, I am representing the university and also the School of Humanities, which is based in the city of Kalamata. We are looking forward to this meeting. I'm sure it will be a fruitful collaboration for the next generations, especially the young people, the students, but also for uh, everyone that would like to come to the Peloponnese, and especially to Kalamata, for a summer course or for his studies. Thank you very much. Κυρία Κέλλη Μακροπούλου, βρίσκεται εδώ εκπροσωπώντα τη μεσαινιακή αμφικτιονία, τον πολιτισμό στην περιοχή μα. Είναι όμω ο συνδετικό κρίκο που μα έφερε κοντά με τον πρόεδρο. So my name is Kelly Makropoulou. I grew up here and I am supposedly the connection uh, that, <laughs> that brought um, in co cooperating with, other, with everybody else uh, that brought us closer. So uh, I, um, I represent the Messiniaiki Amphictioni, Amphictioni, which means the, the Messinians, the people from that part of the Peloponnese, which is called Messinia, the southern part of uh, of uh, the Peloponnese. Uh, these are the people who are Messenian, but who are all over the world. So I sort of represent them today. Ο κύριος Δημήτρης Πατριαρχέας είναι ο Γενικός Γραμματέας της Ένωσης Ξενοδόχων και έχει ξενοδοχεία στην Βόλα. Πέστε, Δημήτρη, μίλα. Well, thank you for having us here. Can everyone listen? I'm okay. I'm from Kalamata. I represent the hotels of Kalamata and the, and the region of Messinia. I would really like to take this opportunity and thank you for inviting us here. Uh, your hospitality is uh, superb. It's a five-star hospitality. <laughs> and, uh, we also promise uh, the same hospitality when you visit us. And now I know the true essence of uh, tourism. Tourism actually is meeting other cultures and other people. So we invite you to come and meet us uh, this summer, especially now that uh, you'll have a direct flight from Boston to Athens after 29th of May. Thank you very much for having us. Kyria Vasiliki Baka has studied here in the America. Είναι πρωταθλήτρια στην κολύμβηση και είναι ένα κορίτσι το οποίο έχει λαμπρό μέλλον και σίγουρα θα προσφέρει πολλά στην πόλη μας. Ευχαριστώ Quickly, before the signing, I just want to have a couple of quick citations from uh, Congresswoman Lori Trahan's office, Jake Masrandria. Jake, come on up and give the 
citation, and then we're going to have two from the State House, I believe. Hi, everyone. My name's Jake. I'm from Congresswoman Trahan's office, and uh, she just was so excited to have me come today and represent her and uh, be a part of this amazing event. And so I'm just going to present this citation from the U.S. House of Representatives upon celebrating the sister city agreement between Kalamata, Greece, and Lowell, Massachusetts, which will further strengthen the diplomatic and cultural relationship of these two great communities. The city of Lowell has had a long storied history of tremendous Greek Americans who have contributed mightily to the community and to the Commonwealth, and this partnership will further enhance the impacts of Greek and American contributions to the arts, culture, business, and public service in both cities. Thank you so much. Thank you. I can present those to the two mayors. Thank you. Next up from uh, Senator, State Senator Ed Kennedy's office, James Ostis, a fellow Greek. James, come on up. Thank you all. Senator Kennedy sends his regrets. He really would have liked to be here today. He's been involved in this process from the beginning, um, but he had formal session today. And he asked me to come and present these citations. Um, so let, there, are, there are three citations, actually. He asked, we originally were going to do two, but we have a third one. Uh, be it here, uh, Commonwealth of Massachusetts State Senate official citation. Be it, be it known that the Massachusetts Senate hereby extends its congratulations to the mayor of Kalamata, Messenia, Greece, Anastasios Basipopoulos in recognition of the establishment of the partnership between the city of Lowell, Massachusetts, USA, and Kalamata, Messina, Greece as sister cities. And be it further known that the Massachusetts Senate extends its best wishes for continued success and that this citation be duly signed by the President of the Senate and attested and a copy thereof transmitted by the Clerk of the Senate. We have another, Senate, another citation. I won't read the entire thing, but it is given to our mayor of the city of Lowell, Sakari Chow. And finally, this, the, mayor, um, the senator would like to have given this citation to my former boss, who I helped him at the beginning of this project, Former Mayor of Lowell, William Samaris, in recognition of your spearheading of the partnership between the city of Lowell and Kalamata as sister cities. So, thank you. Thank you. All right. Okay, so now that for what we've come for, the moment that we've come for, once we get these, the signing of the um, agreement by the two mayors. If anyone's going to take pictures, you might as well come on up and get ready. Be, before we sign this historical document, I also want to follow Mr. Kafka's lead in addition to the great Greek uh, elected officials, uh, business residents, uh, the Moodis family. I also would like to thank Mr. George Barakas, who's also a friend of mine. I spoke with him earlier. He's very excited about this Kalamata City sister with, with the city of Lowell. I also want to thank the Lowell Police Department and the, uh, the escort that they provide to the uh, Kalamata delegation uh, from this morning until the end of tonight. A thank you uh, to the police officers who dedicated their day to, to doing this. And after we sign this document, I also would like to present to you, Mr. Mayor, the key to the city as well. Thank you very much.
Mr. Mayor. Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? You got the key? If you don't mind, Mr. Mayor, if you could maybe step to the yes, front. Yes, yes, thank you. Bill, come stand over here. Yes, Could I have the city councillors come join me in the front? All the city councillors? I don't think I can hold a microphone and, and uh, hold this at the same time, so I hope my voice will carry. You can read it. Thank you, Councillor. <laughs> thank you, Councillor, for joining me. Um, this is the citation. I'm going to just turn it to me. We can do the photos in, in a bit. Let me just turn this around and, and read this real quick here. Citation, be it hereby known to all that the city of Lowell in the Commonwealth of Massachusetts hereby offers its sincerest welcome to Athanasios Vasapulopoulos, Mayor of Kalamata. Kalamata is the capital of Mycenae, Greece, and the major port of Greece and the Mediterranean Sea. This beautiful city hosts 80,000 inhabitants, an international airport, and the main campus of the Peloponnese University. Kalamata was the first city to be liberated in the Greek War of Independence. On March 23, 1821, it was taken over by the Greek revolutionary forces under the, under the command of generals Theodoros Kotronis, Petros Mavromachalis, and Papa Flesas. I hope my Greek is okay today. <laughs> it was rebuilt and has now become one of the most important ports in the Mediterranean Sea. The modern name Kalamata comes from the word Kalamai, reads, the history of this ancient city goes back 3,000 years to Homer who mentions Farai, an ancient city built where Kalamata Castle stands today and the Poseidon Temple. During the recent years, Kalamata has now developed into a modern provincial capital. Today, Kalamata has the second largest population and mercantile activity in the Peloponnese. It makes important exports, particularly of local products such as raisins, olives, my favorite, and olive oil. Yes, yes. Kalamata is the land of Kalamitianos dance. Kalamata olives, olive oil, figs, and silk handkerchiefs. Now, therefore, I, Mayor Sakai Chow, on behalf of all the members of the City Council, hereby extend our gratitude and high expectation of success for our international cooperation and activities established between our cities of Lowell, Massachusetts, USA, and Kalamata, Greece. Given this 28th day of April, 2022, signed by myself and the entire council. Thank you. It's an honor. It's, it's a very, uh, he's very, our mayor is very honored to be receiving this and he will place this in a very important spot in his, uh, in his office, in the mayor's office in Kalamata. And yes, and we will al he will always and we will always remember the way that we were greeted here uh, in Lowell and this is just our first day and we feel so, so wonderful. What's going to happen next? Some hours. <laughs> some hours. Only some hours, and we're so touched. We thank you, everybody. It's really fantastic. It's amazing.
So this started uh, some years ago, and this is a handmade, what can we say? Uh, yes. So yes. So three years ago, this 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 was create. It began to be created. The idea, and I think Bill will uh, handle this a bit better than than I can right now. Uh, yeah. Okay. And um, it's to com commemorate the um, connection of the two cities, Kalamata and Lowell, Massachusetts. Before uh, our mayor mentioned uh, he, the um, the revolution, of, yes. So this connects Bo Boston, eh? Boston, and Kalamata, and uh, yes, and Boston, Massachusetts, and Kalamata, and it's the proclamation of the Messenian Senate to the American nation that there will be a revolution. So it was on the 25th of May, 1821, right? Okay. <laughs> Yes, after the 200 years of, uh, from the start of the Greek Revolution, this book uh, covers the, the story of, the, of how it happened. Yes, for, because of the Greek Revolution, this book was created. Yes. And to honor the 200 years uh, from the beginning of the Revolution, There were five uh, fighters who started the revolution in 1821. And also in the back, the, um, the symbol or the seal of the, what, the Greek, Yerusia? The Messenian, I don't know, Yerusia. <laughs> Senate, okay. <laughs> Alex, senators, okay. <laughs> How many? Okay. There are only 500, they're handmade, so they can be a collector's item. <laughs> and this is Kalamata's flag. Zito y Kalamata, Zito to Lowell.